was trying to get my, my, my feet underneath me, honestly, with just standing, finally standing in front of Tony, who I knew was going to be somewhat of a test when it came to how awkward he was, and he's skilled, and it was going to be really hard to get out there. I was hitting him with some pretty pretty decent ground and pound as well, you know. So, um, dude's, a, dude's a, a tough dude. The kick is one of the greatest knockouts we've ever seen. Uh, anything you drilled, anything you, you, know, you thought might be there, or just something you saw in the moment, what, what happened? Uh, I don't even know if I saw in the moment. I think my, my body just moved and foot <laughs> foot to face and a couple backflips. Um, no, honestly, like I was I was talking to some people. I think sometimes the fights materialize exactly how you want them to. Sometimes you stay within your in your normal box of what you always use, and it works. Sometimes it doesn't work, and sometimes you throw something that you never ever thought you would ever land let alone knock someone out with. So it's not something that we, we train. Um, I think I have the best kickboxing coach on the planet, Henry Hooft. Um, but we don't train a lot of front, front kicks, I will tell you that. And mainly the reason is because I told Henry, <laughs> I don't want to do that, man. It hurts my toes. So uh, my, my right foot is a little bit sore. And uh, I'm a big baby when it comes to my feet getting hit. So uh, didn't train it, but it landed tonight. <laughs>